Hi guys, Albert here. Hey, today I'm going to be talking about a blog team structure. Okay, a lot of people are asking me why I choose the structure what I have on my blog. And there's a reason for that. Uh, it's not a surprise or a secret that I sell my own product and services on my blog. And I structure my blog where I can make money or where people can buy uh, my product and services. And a lot of things uh, has to do with the structure. You know, my structure play a big role on my blog. It's just like a casino here in Las Vegas. If you uh, if you know casino design, they design the casino on only for one reason, for you to spend money. You know, that's why they put the hotel room at the very back of the casino, so you'll walk down the casino, look in the uh, uh, slot machine, restaurant, face, you know, wh whatever, uh, the sports book, and so on, you know. And guess what? You're going to, uh, before you even go to your room, you're probably going to be spending money. And it's the same thing with the blog, you know, with uh, uh, how I structure with my blog. And that's what I'm going to go through with you today, just a basic uh, structure and just kind of explain it to you so it will make sense. So let's go ahead. Okay, first when you land into my blog, you'll see a header graphics, which is this, right? Uh, very important, you know, make sure it's unique. It's not necessarily too graphic -y, too busy and all that stuff. You know, it should be simple and perfect. I would uh, put like a two-tone color, like gradient, you know, and put your title here on the top very important so people will know exactly what your blog is about then the tagline you know uh, tagline for your blog also your picture here or your company logo in my case I have my picture actually here let's draw my picture uh, that's my eyes okay I'm just making a humor here folks okay that's I guess my that's my uh, and then I have one teeth, you know, just messing around. Okay, I have my picture here. Uh, established credibility. If you have your your picture or your logo and and whatever that you can put here that represent your your or convey your product or your services or your company. Now the second thing, as you can see, I have my navigation uh, tab right here, right just below the header. I have the home, you know, and I have my product page. Uh, very important the product page when they click this product page it will take them to all my product and services where they can choose whatever they need there if they want to hire me if they want some templates they want some tutorial training and so on very important product page and about me about a little bit of myself very important as well and contact us you don't want too much uh, uh, things going on there just uh, actually uh, integrate all your major pages or links okay so that is the navigation bar okay on 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 uh, right below the header okay it's right here this is the header graphics okay okay and then right below the header is navigation now to the uh, container body container right okay as you can see if you go to my blog albertaliado.com on my right hand side, which is probably your left, I have an opt-in form, very important, I'll explain why. Okay, you need to capture your uh, visitor's uh, information, uh, opt-in form, so in the future you can market to them, okay. And also too, uh, the reason I put this right here, I structure it right here, because your content is right here on the left. And it has to do with uh, our psychology. As a human being, majority around the world, we read from left to right, left to right, left to right. And guess what? If you send a uh, email to your uh, list or uh, people land it to your blog and read your blog from left to right, uh, you, they'll see your opt-in form there. So it just makes sense from left to right and then they see the opt-in form okay that's why it also too based on the Harvard study um, the uh, uh, BC or the hit map the uh, majority of our eye concentration is in this uh, 
in this section right here. And they call this a golden triangle. Okay, this is what the uh, heat map concentration is. Okay, so very important. So for you guys, the people that want to make money on AdSense, it makes sense to put your AdSense right here. Okay, on inside the golden triangle. Okay, and this is your content right here, all the way to the bottom. Okay, this is your content. Now, as you can see, I'm using three columns. One, two, three. Okay. Um, this one far to the right, my right, which is your probably left. And this right here, the middle column, is very, very important. Because this is actually with complement to your content. If you put your product here, if you showcase your product, your books, uh, DVD course, coaching program, whatever, while the people are scrolling down, okay, you're actually showcasing your related products. And guess what? While you're establishing credibility with your content, they're reading and everything, you're exposing your product right here. Guess what? People are going to click that product, whatever they need, and they're going to buy it. And the the this last side bar right here, you can push put your miscellaneous uh, links like uh, categories, pages, um, recent posts, recent comments, and whatnot. Or you probably put an AdSense there if you want as well, or other things. But it's very uh, simple structure. It's not busy. It makes sense to me the uh, the overall structure. And I kind of just want to share that to you because very important. Like what I said, casino design. Uh, their casino or structure uh, for uh, for only one reason is for you to spend money and the same thing with this it's just like a grocery shop too you know a grocery store they put milk uh, all the way to the back of the aisle so you can walk and uh, maze through the aisle of uh, whatever you need and stuff like that and it has to do with the structure as well so I hope you uh, learned something from uh, this uh, big duo uh, blog post and put it into action you know, you can um, actually get this kind of structure everywhere there on the internet and just kind of customize the, the look and feel and the header. It's very important that you customize the header for branding. Very, very important. I'm big in branding. So I hope you learn, you put it into action. God bless you. Take care. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.